No nation understands the benefits of opening up better than China. That was true under the leadership of Deng Xiaoping and it is true today. But opening up does not occur in a vacuum. It depends critically on a two-way calculus. China's willingness to invite foreign participation in its economy and the world's reciprocal efforts to share its markets with China. Most of all, opening up strategies for China or for any other country must be framed as mutual opportunities for collective engagement. No one country can successfully execute an opening up on its own. China gained so much from its first wave of opening up because the world was ready and willing to welcome China into the global trading system. If I, as I have stressed, today's climate is less welcoming, less hospitable. A higher level of opening up, uh, as you and China now call it, must be acutely sensitive to a much tougher global response. This will work only if the trust, distrust can give way to a renewal of mutual trust. This won't be easy, but shame on us if we squander the opportunity.